Station. Four. Gather. Three. Roll ES yes, Blue. Roll ES yes, Blue. You're up. When Gather approached us with this vision of bringing together all the Christians throughout the world in all of these different languages, uh, we had to think about how we could perhaps help them with the tools that we've already built. We have a history at Renewed Vision of building applications to serve specific needs uh, that will also serve the church at large. And so in this case, they had the vision to show a number of different video streams and show lyrics in 16 different languages. And we had to figure out how we were going to do that so that when they're singing songs in English, we can show uh, all these other languages in their native tongue. And so we, we did some special work in ProPresenter to make that happen, and it's really, really cool. Uh, we, we have the ability to bring in uh, Commodore Limited files, so all the translations were done ahead of time for all of these songs, for all of the scripture, for all of the sermon notes, and they were done and formatted in a, uh, a, a an Excel spreadsheet, basically, that is exported as a CSV, and each column of the spreadsheet is a different language. When we import that in with a special tool that we made for ProPresenter, it allows a single machine as we click on the lyrics in English, we're outputting to 15 other, what's a total of 16 different screen outputs, all of those different languages, all at the same time. And what's really remarkable is we're able to do all of this with just standard Mac minis. The way that we do that is we're using NDI and we're doing it as a single composite uh, of an 8K, an 8K uh, output that is made up of these 16 different separate 1080p feeds. Now, we're doing that for lyrics and for sermon notes. We also have two other machines that are being used for lower third graphics, for uh, lower thirds for what's gonna be coming up next, um, for a, a bug that shows what the, the current city is that's broadcasted, that we're broadcasting from, because again, we're doing broadcasts from seven different locations throughout the world. And uh, to do these little look-ins where we're taking a, a Zoom uh, video from these various, uh, one of 10,000 different gatherings, and we're doing that about every five minutes, looking into these small gatherings that are taking place all over the world and showing where they are from. So we can say, you know, live from Los Angeles gathering or, or something like that. So prior to us having this ability, it really would have required that we run 16 different instances of ProPresenter or some other sort of graphics generator, uh, CG type of, uh, of system. We would have had to have 16 different CG systems somehow synchronized together to show corresponding uh, slides as we show them. So the ability to be able to bring in a CSV file with all this pre-formatted, uh, translated uh, content and play it all off of a single machine really makes the, the workflow a whole lot simpler because the people that are doing the translating don't even have to have ProPresenter. They can just do it in the, in the CSV file. We are laying out those different slides in the appropriate templates in real time as we click on them. And so that also makes it, uh, it, it makes it easy to make last minute changes because as we make these changes to the CSV file, we just have to run it through our tool, bring it in and, and, and we're good to go. So it's, um, it makes for a much simpler workflow when you can imagine when you have 25 hours worth of content, that is a great deal of content that has to be checked and rechecked and, and uh, rehearsed, et cetera. So that, that workflow of just being able to do everything in a single file and being able to provide those files to people around the world is very helpful. The event's gone really, really well. We're almost, uh, I think, 18 hours into this event so far, and there's always some technical issues that you have to work through very, very quickly and, and on the fly, particularly when we're streaming. I believe it's over 400 different streams given the different combinations of uh, graphics, lyrics, and, and notes, as well as spoken languages. So it's really just an incredible event that's never really been done before, so that begats a lot of different issues that you may not see. But the flexibility with the software has been really important to us, and we've had lots of different calls for graphics uh, and QR codes and new uh, pictures or whatnot to show at the last minute. And, and it's only by the flexibility of the software that we're able to, to make that happen. This Gather 25 event is actually a really big deal for Renewed Vision because we have a lot of our teams spread all over the world participating in this and running our software. We have Alex from our technical support team that is in Dallas and leading the charge there. We have in New Zealand, 
Ryan, one of our developers, is uh, is leading worship there and running ProPresenter there. Next, we've got Philip that's in Malaysia. Philip is uh, in this, I believe it's a hotel ballroom that's running worship in that live environment. We have Brad that has done a lot of our video tutorials. He's leading in Rwanda. And then um, there's Amanda. Amanda is in the UK and she's running, she's our product owner for ProPresenter and she's running ProPresenter there. And then Gabby, one of our tech support specialists is actually down in Peru and running ProPresenter there. Here at Master Control, we've got a lot of Renewed Vision employees. We have Jonathan, our president, who's the technical producer for this event. Mitchell is one of the, uh, the show callers for the event. And then running graphics, we've got myself, we have Justin and Robert and Colton from our development team uh, running graphics live. And then behind the camera, documenting all of this is the other Colton uh, that's on our marketing team. So many different people that are involved in using our software in these live events. Uh, it may get the question, why do we do this? Why do we involve ourselves and so many of our team in these live events? Well, Renewed Vision, we have the, the ambition to push the boundaries of what's possible in live events. And that makes involvement in these kinds of events not just a choice, but it's a necessity. Because it's only when we're involved in these live events that we gain experiences that we just can't get in the office. It's when we're involved in live events that we see those and, and, and have to make those split second decisions that only happen in live events. And we're involved in the chaos uh, that inspires creativity. And so it not only inspires creativity, it ignites our passion for why we do what we do. Uh, and it allows us to, to see some of the rough edges in the software so that we can refine those. Um, and it really, it, it strengthens our resolve to provide really high quality products and to transform what is possible in, uh, in a live environment. So it's really just a matter of uh, to be, uh, to have a vision to transform the future of live production it, it means that we can't just observe live productions, we have to be involved in them.